You said Danielle? Yes. And how old are you? Eight. Eight, wow. And who do you want to be when you grow up? Um, a veterinarian. A veterinarian. Oh, that would be very nice. You could help all the animals, right? Mm -hmm. That would be great. We're going to do something really cool. Three brand new decks of cards, all right? All new, all sealed, all direct from the factory. And you get to choose one deck. Whatever deck you choose, that will be the one that we use. And by the way, they are all <laughs> sealed. No, they have never been opened. They are sealed, OK? So Danielle, which one would you like to use? It could be anyone. It doesn't matter. Oh, the other, uh, one other thing, too, is that two of them are red, and the other one is blue. Okay, other than that, they are exactly the same. OK? Uh, Danielle, it doesn't matter. Any deck you want. Is that the one? That's the one. That's OK. That's all right. Here. Check them all out. Inspect them to your heart's content. Hold on to the one that you want. We'll get rid of the other two. Which one do you want to use? That's the one. See, it doesn't matter what deck Danielle chooses, because we're not even going to do a card trick. <laughs> we're going to do a money trick. Ooh. Ah. OK, let's try that again. We're going to do a money trick. Ooh. Ah. Who's got some money? <laughs> Ooh, what, well, you're all married. Is that the problem? Okay. All I need is a $5 bill. And then I need another $5 bill. We're going to try to collect $700 billion. Now, if you're not sure if you have one, the way to find out is to go into your pocket, take out your money, look at it, and then you'll know if you have a $5 bill. You have one. Notice my hands are empty, right? Thank you so much. And thank you so much to brave volunteers. To brave volunteers. No manipulation. No manipulation whatsoever. And what is your name? Annie and you, sir. Bob and you, sir. Annie and Bob. Nothing bad will happen to the money. All right? That's a promise. Nothing bad will happen to the money. That's a promise. Oh, my bad. My bad. No, no. Starting now, nothing bad will happen to the money. Starting now. Bob, hold on to half of your bill. And Annie. If you would, hold on to half of your bill. And I said that nothing bad would happen to the money. Then I tore it up. Does anybody have a lighter I can borrow? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. You guys got worried for one second. I was only kidding. No, I was only kidding. No, I have my own. I brought one. That's what I got at the store. And it doesn't matter because a lot of people don't know this. It's true. Real money will not burn. Did you know that? Real money will not burn. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, that was with coins. No, it doesn't matter. We're not doing a money trick anyway. We're doing a card trick. <laughs> now, Danielle, don't look so excited. All right. The face of everyone every time I've done a card trick. All right. You chose one deck from what? 50, 60 decks? Well, three. But you were holding on to that deck of cards since before I even borrowed the money. Do you concur? You know what I'm saying? You heard? You heard? All right. Open that deck of cards for the very first time. Oh, you got it? Good job. Good job. Inside, there will be a deck of cards, of course, but hopefully something else. Take out the something else that you find and tell everybody it is Money! Two halves of two $5 bills. Thank you. Give me just one half. Just one half. You hold on to the other one. You hold on to one. I'll take the other one. You, sir. Take that half. Match it up to the other half of your bill. Check not just the pair, but especially the serial number on each half. And tell everybody is at the other half of your bill. So does it match? Oh, you said your name? And Annie, you take it. Match it up to the other half of your bill. Check the tear and the serial number. And Annie, is that the other half of your bill? Yes. Danielle, if you would, pass it over to Bob. I won't even touch it. I won't even touch it. Bob, try that half. And Danielle, join me again. And Bob, is that the other half of your bill? Yes. Take a bow, Danielle. Nicely done. Very nice. Wasn't that amazing? Oh, thanks.
That's cool, isn't it? If you think about it, it was amazing because Danielle chose that deck of cards. But even if you didn't, they were sealed. But even if they weren't, you were holding them since before I even borrowed the money. And while you were holding them, then I borrowed the money. I took the money very fairly, and I tore it, and I burned it, and it appeared in there, and I never touched the deck of cards. <laughs> Thanks. So, thank you. So that's what we're going to do. From now on, I'm going to do a trick, and then I'm going to explain to you why it was so amazing. All right? And then later on tonight, I'm going to do some jokes. And I'm going to explain those right after the punchlines. All right? And then we're all going to go out after the show, and we're going to go out for karaoke where nobody sings. Also known as the best kind of karaoke. So any questions on that? That's pretty cool, isn't it? Any questions on that? Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. What's that? Oh, yeah, of course, yes, yes, of course. I did know, I'll try to fix it. And uh, thank you so much. And Annie, if you would, pass yours down as well. You know, I have to be honest, thank you. I saw some skeptical looks. People saying, oh, I'll bet you the serial numbers aren't really the same. And I'm not trying to single anybody out, but I just want to show them just so that they'll be able to see for themselves, all right? It's this one um, up here in, in the red shirt in the back there. Would you look at the, uh, <laughs> look at the serial numbers now? Or do they match? Okay, good. They've confirmed. All right. Let's fix the money. If you would, Danielle, hold out a hand. Let's get rid of all that plastic for you. Hold out a hand. We're going to add up the money. Everybody add up the total amount of money with Danielle and I. Here we go. Oh, good. Nobody got it. Very good. We also have the uh, wallet. What do you see inside the wallet? Anything in there? Nope. We'll place the two torn $5 bills into the wallet. And Danielle, I'll trade you. You take the wallet. I'll take the deck of cards. Put the wallet somewhere where I can't get to. You don't have any pockets, right? No. Okay, here, you could put it on the floor, and you could step on it, but closer to me, if you don't mind. Slide it a little bit over. There you go. And then step on it that way you know I cannot get to that wallet, right? Okay. All right, so let's do something cool. I love to do magic with cards. It's my favorite. And uh, does anybody, anybody ever do any card tricks or anything like that? I've You've tried? Have you, have you done them? Are you still learning? Um, I'm still learning, but I did show my mom one trick. Very cool. Was it good? Oh, yeah. Look, there's the enthusiasm of, a, <laughs> of an encouraging mother, you know? Yeah. I mean, she's, she's eight, so I, was, I know what she's doing. Follow it the whole time. Now, that's how my family used to encourage me. Like, I would have such a hard time learning one new trick when I was starting out, and it would be like weeks that you'd be sitting there practicing and doing it for yourself over and over again. And then I would build up my courage. And the way that my family encouraged me to do magic was different than most. Like, I would finally say to them, okay, you want to see a trick? And they would say, oh, how long does it take? <laughs> and that's how they encouraged me to keep doing it. So I'll show you the cards are all mixed up, all different. Shh. Thank you. I'll do it again. I'll do it again. Oh, thanks. This is pretty cool, too. Oh, that was a good ooh -ah. Very coordinated. No, I've actually, um, this is called the Russian shuffle because it's one card rushing after another. <laughs> no, and I could even do that behind the back of the building. Does anybody want it? No, behind the back. Are you ready? Here we go. And then back up. Yeah. All right. I will turn around. I will turn around. How's that, right? All right. This is even better. This is better. And then back up. Yeah. Thanks. That's harder than it looks. So that's called the Russian shuffle. This is a good one. The Jewish shuffle. Jewish shuffle, also known as Passover. And then my favorite. This is the regular shuffle. And this is the politician shuffle. Seems impressive. Does nothing. All right. Now. Oh, it's true, right? It's true. So let's get serious. Danielle, choose a card. You can have any one you like. Free choice. Doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, any one you want. Doesn't matter. Okay, good. <laughs> good. No, you don't take it. You can have any one you want. Free choice. 52 possibilities. Any one you like. Look at it. Remember, don't tell me what it is. But look at it so that you know what it is. You got it? And put it back in anywhere you want. <laughs> hmm? 
Yeah, I'll try. But I don't know. I can't. I'm, I'm going to try. I'm going to try. Well, let me see. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Well, let me see. Okay. Now I'm going to try to find it again. All right. Hold on a second. Nine. We got it. Nailed it. Is that not good? Is that not good? Doesn't matter. We're not doing a uh, card trick. We're doing a money trick. Danielle, what was in the wallet when we first opened it? Nothing. What did we put into the wallet? The money. The torn five dollar bills. Very good. And you've been guarding it ever since, and he never touched it. Danielle, bring forth the wallet. Slowly open it up, very slowly. Take out what you find and show everybody. Take it out. A brand new $10 bill. Listen to that applause, Danielle, as the two fives become a 10. The two fives become a 10. Isn't that cool? Bobby! Preach. Annie, right? Preach. How about Annie? For Annie. And Bob. And Danielle. You were great. Wasn't Danielle great? What a great volunteer. You did a great job. They love you. So, tell you what, instead of just letting you go back to your seat, I would like to say thank you in a magical way. <clears throat> Thank you in a magical way. <laughs> That's what I want to say. No, we're going to do something very special for you, OK? We're going to make you something. And it's very easy. You just do exactly as I do. this far before. I'll, I'll try it. I'll try to fix it for you. Thank you so much. Annie, right? I'll try to fix yours as well. I have to be honest. People come up to me after the show, and they always say the same things, you know? They'll say like, um, oh, thank you for making my daughter a hat. Here's a 20, or whatever, you know? And um, <laughs> no, if they're cool. If they're cool, they do. If they're cool, they do. If they're cool, they do. <laughs> this is <laughs> my favorite part of the show. Because it uses no props, no wallets, no cards, nothing to distract. The torn $10 bill stays at the fingertips. Where again, it never leaves your sight, not even for a moment. But you'll see that just by folding it, like so. And then unfolding it. The torn $10 bill becomes two new $5 
me to just go. Do you want it? You want me to have it? You do want it? I can have it? I can have a tip? Thank you. Thank you, Bob. Annie, you, um... No, Bob was really cool. Oh, yeah. No, Bob was really cool. Bob was like... No, go ahead, you could have it. And everybody's like, wow, he, he was so cool to do that. Um, do you, should I? Do you, it's up to you, really. If I sign that? You, know, you got it. You got it. No, I appreciate that. Thank you so much. You guys are so nice. Now, I would like to say thank you, Bob, and thank you, Annie. And I'd like to say that you, too, can have your name mentioned. <laughs> For $5. I'll say it from the stage. No, I always say, um, I'll give the money back. When you go to a magic show, you should always get back everything that you came with. So you, get, you keep your trust in magicians. You get your rings back. You get your money back. You get your niece back. You, everything. <laughs> but you should get a little something more. And the something more they get is a reminder. Now, what's the reminder? Think about this. Bob, you gave me $5, so I will give you $5. Annie, you gave me $5, so I will give you $5. But what's the reminder that you get? The reminder is that in the magic show, as in life, we always get what we give. Finger snaps. Finger snaps only. Finger snaps. <laughs> finger snaps. Yeah, if everybody, I'll show you something really cool. Everybody do finger snaps. This is so cool. Watch this. That was rain. Wow. <laughs>